Hi guys, this is the Avanti uh, Primo. Been playing around with it to try and figure out why um, and how to get it to do things that it shouldn't do, which is a nightmare. But uh, it uh, gave up in the end after a little bit of uh, coercion. So, um, mostly everything is done from uh, the DTMF mic. That's where you get most of the things that are there, shall we say. But it's a bit of a bugger to find. Um, so we'll try again. So we go... So you have VFO band, band E, D, C, B, A, and VFO. So we say band B. Then you have to uh, switch it off and switch it on. And you go channel 9. It basically behaves... Uh, there's a 40 channel. Band A. So we try band... Try VFO band again. I think this is all right. There we go. VFO. So let's type in a frequency. So I'm going to go 29990. There it is. As you see. So 3105, 25615. It's a bit awkward to get the uh, export mode via the uh, microphone. So uh, you've got to have a bit about a bit of your wheels about you to figure it out. But um, there we go, back into VFO. I think it's Trying to see if we can get it right eventually, because it's not so easy. Yeah, there we go. It, go. it sets itself into the band that you want. I guess this ends at 065. Yeah. How to get the alpha channels? Not figured that out yet at the moment. But we'll get there. So there is export mode in the Primo. And there it is, it's called VFO, VFO mode, and uh, not so easy as a jumper in a wire, like you're led to believe. Uh, it's a lot to do with the microphone, and that's the uh, secret, really, is the microphone. We'll be back with a review on the uh, Primo a little bit later. This is a 20 watt version, kicks 20 uh, watts. Uh, on uh, FM. Let's see if we can uh, make it go into VFO mode this way. Yeah, so that's it. And 26095 we'll try. And there's the A channel and it keys up. So there you go, Primo export cracked.